Hey, what's up? Derek Kirk here with another exciting tutorial. Oh, this whole thing? Uh, it's just for having 100,000 subscribers. <laughs> Imagine. Okay. Uh, no, thank you all so much. That's fantastic. It's awesome. We'll do something special for that. I, I'm still in shock about it. Okay. So for this video, the people over at Rococo sent me a bodysuit. Thank you so much. Uh, so if it says up here, uh, sponsored, that's what that means. They sent me the whole suit, uh, but I can say whatever I want about the suit. And I do. Also, I say a lot of things that are kind of weird. I promise that I'm not on drugs. I did this video at like 11 o'clock at night on a Friday after a long week. And this is kind of what happens when you have a sleep deprived, stay at home dad, do stuff with the Rococo suit at night. Um, that came out as weirder than it sounds. It's not like that weird. <laughs> So this video is basically just going to be like my first impressions of the suit and stuff once I finally got it working. Also, fun fact, you can make nightmare fuel if you import the Rococo mocap data straight into C4D and render that out. Okay, we're recording. We're doing it live. That's right, we are live, baby. So the Rococo suit is $4,300, but with my link below, you can save 45% on the Indie Bundle. So it's 40% off plus 5% using my code and the link below. So definitely do that. It helps me out a lot. Um, but yeah, I um, mean, if you're into making character stuff, I without, you know, spoiling everything, it is 100% worth it because it is wild. Okay, but yeah, let's get into it. Okay. Look, this whole thing started because I asked them in Instagram. I was like, hey, does your suit fit dad bods? You know, it's like when you're putting it on, when you get it on, you're like, you feel like you're suiting up to be Superman. And in your head, you're like, you're going to be these cool characters and astronauts. You know, and you're like, yeah, and then you look like this. He's got two thumbs and motion tracking. This guy. <laughs> Holy cow. I've done it. Because you've got the motion tracker on okay but check this out <laughs> this is my planet bam welcome to Earth. you know what i'm saying <laughs> welcome to Earth. you know what i'm saying all right it's gonna be way better with the face you know because that's really what sells it but i'm welcome to Earth. you know what i'm saying okay anyway listen to me So yeah, isn't this just like more exciting than watching me sit at my desk and do this? I don't know why. This is a stupid, creepy blue man that's like a knockoff, cheap version of what's his face is Robin Williams' character from Bicentennial Man. What? I've lost my mind, um, but you know, worth it, right? The <laughs> the Rococo Studio full motion suit two bundle with smart gloves and the face tracking head rig, which does use an iPhone, which to me, that sucks. Okay, so this thing, anyway, we'll talk about pros and cons. I finally got it set up. I had a lot of troubleshooting I had to do. A lot of it was on my end with the fact that my computer doesn't have Wi-Fi built in. I had to get my Wi-Fi router up to date, power bank supply, all this stuff. Okay, so the whole suit and everything is very, very cool. It feels high-end. I feel like I look as cool as this guy. I don't, you know? He's got cool hair. Look how stupid. I look like, like, off-brand Gambit or something. I don't know. I don't know. You know? I like just extra Cajun. I don't know. Anyway, we've got the Smart Glove. The whole bundle is four grand, but this is the Android version. We'll talk about that in a second. We're using the iOS version, which is also four grand. So that, to me, is... The first thing that I think is odd, um, the price is the same. One comes with one where you have to put your phone in, so you need an iPhone. Um, the other one comes with one that has the head rig camera built in and it hooks into the suit so you don't have to use your phone. To me, that is way, way, way better. Um, but I guess people with iPhones just want to show off their iPhone. I'm just kidding. Um, but basically, yeah. Uh, the fact that they're the same price is odd. I would expect this thing over here to be way cheaper. Um, but yeah, what are you gonna do? But I will say the app works very well. Um, super easy, works instantly. My wife's phone is just low on battery and it keeps shutting off. So that's why that keeps happening. <laughs> yeah, you just can't help but overact in this. Also, I think I'm slightly losing my mind. I've been fiddling with this thing forever. And a lot of it's user error on my part, but oh my gosh, we got it working. 
and man, the door, like, oh, the, the possibilities of this, I've just, the door's opened up, right? Like, oh, all, and like a little kid in a candy store right now, except I look like a grown man in a candy store. The suit is fantastic. It's very, super cool. Once you get it working, it's like, <laughs> like, this is insane that I'm doing this and the fingers are perfect. There's no latency at all. Like if you had multiple people and you needed like, <laughs> you know, <laughs> crazy. Is it worth the money? If you want to make professional grade motion capture stuff in your home or in your studio, yeah, man, the possibilities versus the payment worth it, in my opinion. <laughs> okay, I love it. I think it's cool. I think it's great. I can't wait to make more of it. But yeah, as far as customer support goes, it was fantastic. Check this out. I got the first suit. First suit broke right in the crotch. Zipper broke. The guy's like, he's never seen that before. I know. I get it. <laughs> I know, what can I say? But basically, then I get a new suit. He's like, okay, here, just transfer the sensors from that suit to this suit. I'm like, okay, cool. And so I do that. But what I didn't know is that you have to do that exactly right. Because these things, if you twist them the wrong way, and you don't Velcro them in just right. Yeah, it's a little, it's a little fidgety. What I'll say is that this rig, <laughs> it opens up a door to acting, which is huge for me. And that may not be your thing. Like, okay, cool. I just want to have people do it or something like that. But you don't even have to act yourself. You can just get the Rococo Studio, get pre-made things, whatever. But the suit for four grand, that you, you can't, I couldn't get a studio space. I couldn't get a camera, the gear I needed all for that. And all I need for this is the suit and the head rig and stuff. And it's like all combined in the studio. And now I could do, I don't know why, but look for real, for real though, we be serious. I look ridiculous, but I feel cool. So, you know, if I want to lark, is a knight, a medieval knight, in a battlefield. I can, and then I can build it, and then I can make it a thing, and I can share it. That is amazing to me. The idea that I, me, Derek, can be, like I used to want to be an actor. Okay, that's what I did. In college, that's what I did. And uh, for sure, yeah, I'd, in some short films and stuff, and that's what I wanted to be, and I kind of realized that. I like the stuff behind this camera just as much as the front, and there are a lot more jobs behind the camera where I live. Uh, so that's the path I went. And now I can be an actor. I can be myself with better humans. I can be anyone else with other characters and things. And I can be inside of either Unreal Engine or Cinema 4D to build it or whatever. And then Unreal Engine to render out animations and short films. I can be an actor, a set creator, a director a cameraman, an editor, everything from my office in my house. Like, I don't need a green screen studio. Like, the for $4,300, right? It's a lot. Don't get me wrong. With the gloves, which I would highly recommend. Like, if you're going to do motion tracking, these make it, okay? But yeah, $4,300, you get everything. This with the studio software which is amazing and very easy to use and has a lot of good troubleshooting stuff as well all of that to say if i wanted to do anything like this and you have to kind of put it in perspective because right off the bat i'm like four thousand dollars for a new motion tracking suit i just rather get a 250 90s for that right but what it does is it opens a door of opportunity to literally be an actor, be someone who captures the motion stuff. So if, you're, if you don't want to act, like, should you invest in it? If you know someone who does want to act or you want to make short films and you want to be a director and you want to be 
you know, the set creator and you want to do the lighting and you want to do all that stuff, but you don't really want to spend all the money on all of that gear and you want to do it digitally inside of Unreal Engine or something else or whatever program you want, you can. And my gosh, it's $4,000, a lot easier pill to swallow than any kind of high-end camera, lighting gear, studio space, actor payment, any of that stuff. And the fact that you can do it all from your home in your office is wild. Like, I am so excited to make make some stuff. And it's like, you know. Oh, I know what I'm saying. I'm probably going to cut that out. Yeah, so lots of cool stuff to come.